can't drive anywhere <clears throat> until the fog clears off my window. It's this one, right? You put it on this, and you put it on heat, and it's supposed to clear up your, uh, your whole stuff. Right? Let's see. Is it working? Is it working? Is it working? So, people always ask me what the weather's like in Texas, and the truth of the matter is, no, people in Texas don't know. We don't know what the weather's gonna be like. I forgot to do something for work. And so now I'm like, ah! I'm also hungry. There's that. I'm Veda. What's, what's today today? Day 10? I don't know. I just want this week to be over. Um, real quick, I'm going to respond to some Sabrina, not Samantha, Sabrina, um, who is a VEDA vlogger. By the way, if you're doing VEDA, you should join the Facebook group, VEDA2013, I think is what it is. And, you know, like, it puts you in touch with all the other people who are doing VEDA, um, and it's a cool way to f find new people on YouTube. But anyways, I'm going to respond to her, la to yesterday's, um, vlog about being an emerging adult. Um, is this theory that was created back in the days from 18 to 25 we're not uh, an adolescent and we're not a young adult yet which is interesting because you would call usually me 22 years old a young adult and this theory says no you're not a young adult yet you're an emerging adult you're becoming a young adult and that made me think hmm the main difference i've noticed in the short time of my life um, of being uh, an emerging adult the main difference is and the scariest difference is autonomy and that's you know this idea of self-rule like if something goes wrong in my life it's usually because I did or didn't do something if if I don't have what I want right now it's because I did or didn't do something and that is scary I live in Austin, Texas because I decided to live in Austin, Texas. If I want to go live in Afghanistan, I'm the only one who can make that decision. And that's the scariest thing about being an emerging adult or becoming an adult. is this notion that there's no one to tell you what to do. And that's fine, but when to do it. Over here stuck at the same job for seven years because you don't, you don't know if you want to move on. That's what's scary. That you have to tell yourself when to do something. When is the right time to go back to school if you want to go back to school? When is the right time, you know what I'm saying, to move? If you want to just move and go to somewhere where you don't know anybody. Anybody. It's all up to us. And that's scary. So, um... Let me ask a question. I'll pose a question. That's always good to see y'all's responses. To the people who watch my videos who are my age and younger, what's the scariest thing about being my age and younger? Tell me. If you're older than me and you watch my videos, what? Does it get better? Tell me in the comments if it gets better or not. And if it don't, I don't know what to do, man. Oh, yay. My windshield's clear. Time to go to work. Now, Whataburger is a state treasure. Praise God! So, yeah.